Please, don't kill me. I'll tell you everything. There is. The sentry will ask, has your journey been long? You must answer, we have many more miles to cover towards Rome. Cheeky bastards. What? But... Fine. Take it. Just spare me. We can't spare this man. If anyone learns of this, Mithridates' camp will be on high alert. I won't tell anyone. I promise. Oh, you are too kind. No one will ever hear of this. I swear it by all the gods. Good. The uniform fits you well. Don't you want to make a beautiful corpse? They said Mithridates had 300,000 men. Seeing this, I believe it. If we make even one mistake, we may not have a choice. Sorry, we'll be fine. Just let me handle the sentries. Oh there, scouts. Has your journey been long? Welcome back. You look like you need a rest. All right then, in you go. Did you get that in Mithilene? I'll send Acacia to your tent to dress it tonight. If you leave it unattended, it'll fester.
see the Roman talking to the king. I was out front when he arrived. Why is a Roman senator dealing with the king? Uh, that's none of our business. Three campaigns I fought for him. He was the best commander I've ever served under. Do you believe the rumors? I heard Archelaus was defeated by a Roman legatus with no experience leading an army. I saw it with my own eyes. I barely got out of Mytilene alive. Man's family lives in Kizikos, you know. It feels weird to sit out here waiting for them to starve. I have no power to overrule an Imperator. You know that. I only need you to discredit the campaign of Licinius Lucullus. You made it impossible for me to turn the Senate when you cornered Marcus Aurelius Cotta. Rome will not leave one of their own behind, least of all a consul. Hmm. As long as he is safe and sound inside the walls of Gargedon, I still believe he can be rescued. Then we must take the city and secure him as hostage. One thing at a time. I heard rumors that Troas and Musia are on the cusp of leaving your alliance. Impossible. I have contingencies to ensure their loyalty. I hope you're right. Without them, your siege on Kitzikos is lost. My army outnumbers Lucullus's legions 25 times. Don't underestimate him. That is the mistake Archelaus made. Keep the supplies flowing, Skyavola. That's all I need from you. I will take Kitsikos and Chalcedon, and you will reap the rewards. Corvinus will see to it personally. He is among my best men. My services are yours as long as the Senator commands, Your Majesty. Very good. Safe journey home, Senator. Oh, I'm not going home. My brother is handling things just fine in Rome. I'm going to see a mutual friend in Thrakia. Ah, yes. Give him my regards. I shall. Good day, Your Majesty. That must be it. We won't get an opportunity like this again, so let's make sure we've made the most of it before we leave.
Woman, tell me, what is the mood among the soldiers? What do they say about the war? Hmm, they understand they are outnumbered. Loculus is hatching some plan to turn it to his advantage, no doubt. Your accent. You sound Roman. I see. Why did you join my war? The Romans are not so bad. They are a warlike people, stubborn in their conquests and proud of their republic. It is only natural that two warlike people should meet in war. The Roman senator, Tiberius Vitellius Scaevola. He has vested business interests in this region and he is a good friend of Pontus. They are a stubborn people or else they would have succumbed like Musia and Troas. It's a well-fortified city, but they will not hold out for long unless our enemy finds a way to relieve them. We must ensure that doesn't happen. He is a formidable commander, and very well cultured for a Roman. He is known as a lover of Hellenic culture, and he is the ruler of a mighty nation, but he is no Cornelius Sulla. This time, Pontus will prevail. So say the reports. The new legatus of the second of Loculus's legions. Soon he will decorate a cross along the road to Rome. Mark my words. Archelaus was the finest general of his generation. And he was a dear friend. You are uncommonly well informed. Best not speak too openly of such matters. I encourage my soldiers to voice their opinions. Thank you for sharing your thoughts on this war with me today. Now, be about your business. Thank you. 
Stratigos, do you bring any news? Let's have a look. <sighs> a cruel backhanded agreement between two equally power-hungry men. Thank you. This document will shortly burn on one of these braziers. With Apollon's help, no one but us will ever know of its existence. Your virtuous deed will not go unrewarded. Our troops will withdraw from the siege of Kitsikos today. Without us, Troas will leave as well. I am certain that Mithridates will be forced to abandon the siege. You will always be welcome in Mercia as long as I am ruler.
day to you, honored Romans. Have you need of food or medicine? It was you who got rid of Theophilos, isn't it? I always liked Zenobia. I will give you a discount. It's good to see you again. What do you seek? day. Why are you so angry about this? He's an honest person. Honest? He's a thief. He steals other people's property. Are you sure you know what honest means? Well, he is honest about being a thief. Hello again. Or north. Why? It's cold up there. They prefer the cold to the war. Legate. Some wealthy looking When does your next shift begin? Requested a... I'm off guard duty. We've allowed them to wait in your tent. What did you do to earn that? Uh, took an extra ration. You idiot. Domina. What do you need? So where do Mersia and Travis stand now? Are they on our side? I guess. I don't know how much use those turncoats will be, though. If they'll abandon Mithridates that easily, why should we trust them? Legate, 
You look majestic today. Legate, I am at your service, as always. Good day. Our way, Legate. Morale has been better. Many Legionari seem disillusioned by the progress of the war. But the situation is far from unsalvageable. I believe a few victories is all the men need to rally around your command. We're nearly at full strength. We could use a few more recruits to fill the ranks, but we're ready to complete whatever task you set for us. With a little more experience, I believe Legio Weaktrix will soon be the finest fighting force ever to serve Rome. Finally, someone with decision-making power. <clears throat> A glorious commander of Romans. My name is Athanasius. I am here to offer you a most lucrative opportunity. I am reliably informed that you have a surplus of prisoners. Here is my offer. Sell them to me and I shall pay you handsomely. I'll resell them, of course. A lot of people need Servi, and soldiers are physically fit. What else do you think I would do? Pickle them? Fair. I swear to you that I will not resell them to your enemies. The Servi will be sold in Rome. Not you, specifically. Everyone needs money. Your prisoners must be a constant drain on your resources. You have to feed them, after all. In the end, I'm afraid you'll have to execute them or sell them to me. Killing them would be such a waste, wouldn't it? Because I pay the best of prices. And because everyone else is too afraid to ask. I buy the best products and sell the best products. That generates a lot of profit. I and my associates will pay you a fixed fee for the right to take possession of all prisoners, present and future. We will take delivery once every fortnight. Does that sound good? A pity. We could have been great partners, but it is what it is. We shall leave your camp and disturb you no more. Salway. So 